Hello everybody and welcome. I am back into uh, Myth of Empires here. Apparently I'm hoping stuff is loading. I mean I still have stuff in my inventory so I'm guessing my place is still here. Uh, um, could have swore I ended inside the place over there. But whatever, I guess that's fine. Close enough. Oh, wait a second. Perhaps to deploy a territory banner. Did this like roll back a hair? Uh, I think it did. Should be a. It's weird because the stairway's still here. Chests are still here. Odd. Yeah, it. I mean, it does look like some of this stuff didn't get done. Oh, I don't have the. Yeah, it did roll it back. I don't have the loom. Weird. I wonder how that works. I mean, not the end of the world, but yeah, and I have the. I, I didn't build the upgraded stuff, so. What the hell? And it's kind of messed up, honestly, but it's better than losing everything, but still, what the hell, man? Let's look at the bone stuff. Yeah, great guild tech and guild skill. I definitely did that. Doing that, play.
Okay, well, whatever. Still want to build, uh, build a roof to this place. But honestly, <clears throat> not going to be here that long. So we'll build the basic stuff here, and then, uh, I mean, it's already, I'm already high enough level to move on. But, if there is some clay and stuff down here, that would not be a bad thing to have. Uh, and actually a horse would be a really great thing to have. Need that. The flowers. You make wow. All right, so the rains I always make a couple because they can break. And I'm building too much stuff. Oh, it's not even a tree. Alright, at some point, if I can grab a uh, starter horse, that wouldn't be a bad thing. It'd get me to the next area a little bit faster, because there's nothing really that pressing right here. There's one thing that would uh, be for a mission, but that's going to be a little ways. So this is our uh, clay, which they used to call wet sand. Made a no sense. Also, an easy way to get fish. Which I'm not going to be able to use. It'll probably go bad by the time I actually use it, but. Where did it go? But I must as well grab it while we're here. I mean, as fast as I'm gaining, I don't think that's even the right type of fish to make fish oil with, but we'll find out. Oh, wait. I have this thing. Did I not make grease? I could have swore I did. Oh, I put the put the damn bark away.
That's actually what I need. This is actually just food. Horse food. But I will need that eventually, but... Boundary marker, yes. Not that that's going to be all that necessary, unless I personally piss off a lot of things. Which, uh, you know, bandits and stuff. Which is possible. Foxes and wolves and plenty of bones. This is true. Yeah, I'm going to have to have a wildflower bin.
Yeah. Let's go mess with that horse a little bit later. Putting these up. Oh, dang. Boy, that sucks. Uh, I don't think it's the end of the world, but... Be a little non buildable area there. So just move this thing. stuff that should have done the side quest yep Did, what didn't I just do this oh yes complete okay um Uh, luckily, I don't have to worry about the radius of that thing. Now that I think about it, I should have enough. Oh, okay. I have enough to make another rain, which is good, just in case. If I can grab this horse. That would be great.
getting ahead of the missions here. Yep, crap bone, axe, and hammer. Got those. Oh, clay by the river. Did that. Yeah, clay buildings. Uh, apparently, this is not a thing done yet. Let's go back and do it again. Which is not that big of a deal. Now, I definitely know there's no copper anywhere in this area. Which means I probably should just move on before I start building anything else. So I kind of need the freaking horse. Okay, well, I don't know what the hell happened to that horse. Oh, there's one. Okay, we'll go after that guy. Okay, if I recall how to do this, you just throw this stuff. Actually, it would help if I knew what level they were. Let's go for the higher level guy over here. Oh shit. Yeah. There we go. Got him. Uh -huh. So the reins have to be in the zero slot to do this. And then basically you just run them around. You see that ranking level's going up, but it's the obedience uh, that really matters. Once the obedience is all the way up, then it's tamed. But that anger level... Uh,
is super angry. And basically, you just have to get off of him once he's angry, and then he's going to run around for a bit, and eventually he'll calm down. But uh, <clears throat> just recommend keep an eye on him. Unless you're in like a, in a closed area, sometimes it's hard to follow where the hell they go. Kind of like that. Back there. Now you do have to give them some time to uh, calm down. Yep, basically be nice and sneaky and then grab him once you get close. Basically once he starts spotting you. Now I think with the higher level range and stuff this goes a little bit faster, but worry about that on the next horse. The upgrade horse. Had to put it in the wrong direction. Cool. Yeah, go back down that way.
And that's kind of why you need to keep an eye on the horse. Because uh, I did not, and now I have no idea where the hell he went. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Shit. Nope, I have to go for it. Nice. Oh man, we're actually doing pretty good. He's gonna throw me before uh, before he maxes out, which means one more ride. He wants me to tame him. He's like, yeah. Just slowly walk. Can't see ya. And run up and shit. Oh shit. Double back, double back.
Cool. That should do it. Hey, this is going to be, um, Clyde Flopper. Okay, now I just need a saddle. Kind of surprised I didn't uh, get close to breaking any reins on that one. But that's cool. I have a couple extras for next time. Take a nice amount of bark. Construction bench requires copper ore, huh? Well. Ah, cool. Got the mining stuff. Which isn't going to help me right now, but it will help me later on. this for that side quest i think i only need two pieces but hey crow what's up man how you doing <clears throat> i'm just messing around uh myth of empires here finally got a private server working so now my stuff isn't going to decay in like after two days of not playing so like i can actually like make some progress in the dang game instead of losing everything Yeah, but how you doing? How's everything? <laughs> I know, right? Not a game that a lot of people have been playing. It's not even available on Steam. I'm sure you're uh, familiar with the legal problems with this game. All right, some saddle, uh, armor and a saddle. Boom. Got myself a horse. Sure. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was playing it a while back, like, but I was playing online with a bunch of dudes and they were advancing way faster. They were playing it way more than I was. I just I couldn't keep up, so I was basically playing by myself anyway. <laughs> it's like, why bother worry about the two day thing when I could just start a private server and do stuff at my own pace. Plus, then I can tweak the XP uh, and the drops a little bit. Make it a little bit easier on myself. With the drop rates and the uh, uh, attack and stuff. I may have overdone it on the uh, XP, though. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. It's just... Like, I'm almost to where I was at when I was playing before, which is uh, pretty significant. Like, I don't remember what level I was. I think I was over, like, 40. And I'm already at, like, 25, and I've only been playing for a couple hours. Uh, it doesn't really matter, because you still have to get all the resources and, you know, find the spots and stuff for it, so... But anyway, <laughs> so you Ben, I saw that you uh, you had jumped on some uh, Warframe. I think it was Warframe. I saw you were on. Uh, saw a notice on Gilded that you'd st you were streaming uh, earlier. Oh, I'm using the wrong tool for that. Branches, rubble, and clay. So just have him follow me. Oh, for an hour. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because you got to do the uh, the new stuff, right? That whole uh, Zeremin. Well, it looks like they fixed the drop rates, though. I actually got the uh, Jiry Blueprint and I think one of the other parts while I was playing, which it didn't, you know, it wasn't like infinite time and still didn't get it, so drop rates are definitely better than what they were. Yeah, I think later today I should have the last of the evolving weapons done. You, you did all the quests. Yeah. Well, now you gotta do all the bounties <laughs> and do all the stuff, right? Collect all the blueprints and all that good stuff. Three, three. Nice. Yeah. Did you get your horse face out of the tree that I'm chopping? Yeah, I need to uh, need to log in and start evolving the last of those weapons, but 
There's only one one weapon blueprint I don't have, but getting the parts for this weapon is a pain in the ass. Our holy cow. That's pretty nuts. Arcane Energize isn't one that drops out of uh out of the new stuff, or that you get from the new stuff. Isn't that one from uh Elodons? Ah, oh. man, that must be a pain to get. Like, I my arcane energize is only like rank rank two or something. But I don't really do Elon hunts, so I probably I I probably need to like actually do them. Uh, I need to do one for the night wave, the uh, tri cap, but not very motivated to do it honestly. And then the other thing would be that, like, yeah, the, the new stuff, like, the new area, like, the room and all that stuff, like, I don't know. I just don't really care about it. <laughs> like, decorating it and all that, like, eh. I think the thing that, like, really makes me not care too much about it is that you can't, like, clean it up. Uh, there's one that gives you energy 100% change. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I probably have it already. I pretty much have gotten, like... A lot of those just from fighting the angels uh, in order to like build the, the weapons that come from the bounties uh, but you can you can buy pretty much all of those too for for standing and you can get standing pretty easy in that No, there's box area. Spirits, no, okay, shit like that. A wooden bed.
wooden gateway, wooden gate. What is that other one? Gateway. Wooden gate with four walls. Uh, wooden gate. I need really. Gateway with gate needs. Uh, need more damn sand. Oh, we're out. You look in this inventory, and for some reason, he stops following you. Needs more sand. Okay, so wooden gate, and then four walls. Yeah, I kind of like some of the new, the new amps. Uh, there's especially one that does like extra damage for an amp. I mean, it's just like amp damage. So something like that um, would make Illidan hunting a hell of a lot easier. Break this horse's back with all the weight on him. Actual bed down. Is 
is uh, pretty unnecessary, but what the hell? I'll worry about all the guild stuff at the next base. Yeah, if this was like the actual game and I cared about stuff decaying, oh, you, well, you can see that for some reason this banner uh, expires in two days, um, which would cause the decaying rate to start on pretty much anything that's built in the area. Oh, I guessed it pretty good, but yeah, there's still a corner of it that is out. It probably is fine. But normally this would start to decay if that was out of that barrier. So you'd have two days and the structure would decay. And then especially like this where it doesn't have that much durability. Yeah, you're talking like less than a day. And then uh, this wasn't lined up properly. This would be have to be in that barrier. Luckily, I don't have to worry about that. Yeah, and then if I actually cared, I'd start making a big circle around this place, but I don't. Lay foundation. Can I do that here? Probably need some kind of bench to do that. Which is fine, which is fine. What am I missing? Oh, branches. All right, might as well start loading up the horse to get out here and go to the next spot. I really don't need most of this stuff. I could come back for it, basically. Oh yeah, right. Forgot to put food in him. He needs he's gonna need to eat.
Oh man, and those got turned the other way. are doing it too. The OCD of the zigzag pattern here, like this one being sideways instead of up and down. Mm. Killing me. Luckily, as soon as I build this, I'm leaving, so I'll have to look at it. There is a way to do it where it changes the pattern. I thought it was just by the way you were standing, but I don't know. Maybe not. Shit. I was wondering if it was one or two. Apparently it's two. Okay. Arrows, not bad. Need copper ore for the guild stuff, which is fine. Oh, I can start making cabinets, which are way better than the uh, storage units, the or the uh, chests. And last one. Then we'll do a little, uh, take a little journey. But if I ever do come back and decide to, like, build this up for whatever reason, uh, now there's plenty of area to build all the structures and all the workbenches and all that stuff. Uh, chances are I'm not going to, but just in case. Orc, uh, I don't think there's anything else I really need in here. Leave that in there just in case. This doesn't really weigh anything, so I might as well grab it. Nope, I can build care all that though.
Hmm. Yeah, those are gonna be a problem. Yeah, let's do uh maybe that. Yeah. I don't necessarily need all the branches, but I mean, I guess I could just turn them into foundations. I will need a bunch of foundations. All right, excellent. Well, I'll go find a new place. So I th I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, there is some kind of quest that's like right up in here. It's either here or it's over here. I think you can buy stuff in this place. So it must be down here. But where I am going is going to be right about here. Ah, oh, crap. Horse is overloaded. Alright. Um, we could leave the flowers. Hey, Bam, how you doing? I am doing well. Uh, yeah, I just figured I'd come mess around on, uh, but you know, I kind of don't need this, this. Always built another one. Yeah, I wanted to just come mess around on uh, Myth of Empires and... What? Steampunk builds, like, using, like, redstone? Oh boy, this dude is not fast. Oh, it's a mod? <laughs> That's cool. Shit, maybe just something else. What do I leave? What do I leave? I mean, that sounds pretty cool, though. It sounds like you could make some awesome stuff. Or at least, like, kind of wild-looking stuff. Alright, it's more like it's still pretty slow, but... I do believe... Where is it? There's a way to switch over to the horse.
Hmm. Yeah, either way. <laughs> you playing on a friend server? Cool. Man, we, uh, I stayed on for quite a while on, uh, Sea of Thieves with those dudes. Uh, did you see the whole thing about the, uh, the Megalodon, that, like, ghost Megalodon thing? Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> That was kind of wild. Uh, we were definitely not ready for it, apparently, but... Yeah, it sucks. We, we weren't able to do that part. We weren't able to, uh, to beat it. But then we, like, went out and fought some dude, and he killed me a bunch of times, and then we came... Well... I killed one of the guys, and then they went back and sunk his ship. Uh, I don't know. It was pretty fun, though. I don't think we I actually made any money <laughs> yesterday. Like, at all. I think I lost more money from buying those, like, cannonball crates and stuff. Uh, but, whatever. Oh, yeah. I forgot I was supposed to be putting in talents. Yeah, and rolled those back too. At some point, yeah, I think that would be cool. Um, like, I don't know if these guys are going to be playing today or not. Uh, I, I know that they planned on playing like later tonight. Uh, but since I have work tonight, like, I don't think I'm going to be joining them. But, I might play a little bit, uh, earlier. I just don't know if, you know, they're going to be available or what. Alright, so this is considered the outpost. A couple of dudes over here. I don't really have weapons to fight these guys. Not yet. Yeah, we should. I mean, we should definitely get together and do that, Bam. Um, I mean, hell, maybe even just a little bit later today. Uh, I, I want to at least like move over here and get this base set up and do some things here uh, in this game real quick. But uh, like I said, I don't know what time like my buddies are getting on, and I don't know if those other guys are going to get on. Uh, but I, I think they said that the Megalodon event is over. Um, as of today, but they also said that the server was down today for maintenance, and I don't know how long that is, or, or you know, how that works exactly. But they said once, <laughs> or <laughs> yes, this is Chinese land pirates. Yes. <laughs> how you doing, sweetie? Uh, good to see you as well. I'm, uh... Yeah, I started a private server on this game, so all my stuff wouldn't disappear if I didn't log in, like, every two days. I'm pretty sure these guys are friendly. Yeah.
but yeah, I'm just horsing around at the moment. Um, literally. But I'm just going to go over to the new area. I'll set up the new base. Um, and that'll get me to the new, the next level of technology, which is copper. Um, but the way that the, the server settings are set, I should get to iron, like, the moment I get copper. <laughs> the moment I get copper, I should be ready for iron, so, uh... It's just a matter of getting the stuff, collecting what I need, building the, those that tier of weapons, and then, uh, gathering my resources. It's definitely a more peaceful game than Sea of Thieves. A lot less uh, killing. Man, you know, <laughs> that was one thing about playing that game too, is like, we're traveling with that headwind where like the, the sails couldn't catch the wind. It's like, oh my God. But if you have the wind with you, like you actually travel pretty quickly. So it's kind of a 50-50 shot whether going somewhere is going to take forever or it's going to be pretty quick. Oh shit. Oh no, that's not good. Oh, that is really not good. I didn't bring that spear. Oh, this is the... Okay, this is the copper mine. Oh shit, that wolf still chased me. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys. Kill that wolf. Kill the wolf. Fight the wolf. Oh, it's still chasing me. Oh god. <laughs> I don't know if I can outrun it. That guy's on my ass. And I don't even have a spear. Oh, I read it. Stamina! Oh, God. Alright, I guess we're doing this. I have to kill him with an axe. Oh, there's the ways are two of them. Like I didn't, I'm not gonna need this act or the spear. Why would I need my spear? I'd always build a new one. Look, if you keep moving, they have a hard time hitting you. <laughs> wow, I am a warrior. These wolves are nothing but bone. There's a nice spot up here, too, that I found on the uh, beta where animals get stuck. But I 
kind of don't need that uh, as the drop rates are a little bit increased and uh, and I kind of know what I'm doing for the most part now I think yeah there's a nice flat area over here Yeah, this looks pretty good. Wow, that's quite the drop off. Can you get your horse butt out of my way? It's too tall. Oh no. I'm not going to be able to go that way. Which means I guess that just uh, doesn't get built. We have funky looking base. Oh no. <laughs> Oh uh, no. Okay, I didn't plan that all that well. Oh, got some higher level horses. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be messing with them right now. Those, one of those. Actually, let's get two of those going. Oh, that, okay. I was going to need two sets of search for that, but that'll work. Cool. Yep, let's do that. Yeah, this base is definitely going to have a uh, bigger second floor. Is missing. It's probably the rope.
Didn't put a stair over there, did I? All right, so there won't be a stair on that side. Need more wood. Yeah, so what do you guys got going on today? Bam, you'll have to like, uh, send me some like screenshots of some steampunk Minecraft stuff. Because I'm not 100% what that looks like, but it sounds awesome. I do believe that's copper. Oh no, Chris Anson interviews. <laughs> oh shit. Why don't you have a seat over here? Are you, are you, are you talking about um, the, the actual show, Catch Predator? Or is there like some new kind of like interviews with him that have, have to do with that or <laughs> what do you have in the bag yeah why would you drive 600 miles oh podcast interviews oh wow Apparently that's what he's been doing, huh? Yeah, I haven't I haven't heard about anything to do with that guy in quite some time. Yeah, put our loom. Actually, you know what? Let's put the bed over here. Cabinets. A little twisted, yeah. Yeah, I do need all those benches, but I don't need that right now. No, well, I guess I might as well build them. Play clean sand.
Too much creep. Guessing I'm not using the copper ore for this benches. Okay, that guy, that guy, we need this one. This is the copper ore, but I think I need more. So you got copper ore, three pieces of clay. Okay, that should be pretty big stuff right there. Too close to the spinning wheel. Alright, so actually there's one that's going to go in a corner over there, so let's put this here.
Ooh. Broke branches, hide and bone. Hardwood, I think. I think that goes in here. Ah, sweet. All right. Oh, wow. Oh, that's cool. So there's like gears that like turn stuff and what is is what's powering it? Like what what turns the gears? Is it like a chimney right there? Like a fireplace? Is this steam? Holy cow. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right, yeah, this has got the other stuff in it. I need not the kiln, but the furnace. Claystone sand. Roll. Oh, there's a steam engine. Man, it's kind of crazy. But also pretty cool. I have not seen such a thing. Yeah, yeah. I kind of saw that in the distance and I was like looking at like how the gears were connected. And it, yeah, that's wild. I have not seen a thing like that yeah so you have like a hopper that has like that is a furnace that's going that i guess produces steam that turns the wheels so what do you have what do you what do you what's all connected to that like what is the steam engine running like what is it what is its purpose like what do all the cranks and stuff do over there arms in oh, over the head trolley oh over oh interesting
A steam-powered train? Seriously? Oh, dude. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, I think the most advanced or craziest thing I ever built really was just like the um, redstone powered trolleys or like, I mean, not even it's it's like a red, redstone powered tracks where like when you put the cart over it, it like pushes it. So I made, you know, some tracks that went from like one side of the world to like a whole, you know, another base that I built like out in the distance. Yeah, I mean, Minecraft is is pretty fun itself, just in general. Uh, but yeah, well, like once you played a, a bunch of it, just vanilla, like how it's meant to be played. Yeah, throwing in mods would definitely add some new life to it. Um, one thing that I was doing uh, is you can in VR you can like go to people's made worlds and like just explore the stuff that they have there. Um, and there's some really cool stuff. Uh, one of them, they had the, uh, uh, what's it called? The Electra? And there was, like, um, levels that you'd, like, you'd fly through and, um, like, that was pretty dope. The only problem is that because Minecraft uses RTX, um, some of the worlds you like if you don't have RTX like you can't go into them which sucks cuz i don't have RTX at the moment and i'm not going to spend all that money just to play minecraft <laughs> now when, eventually one day when i upgrade the card and all that good stuff yeah maybe but uh i'm not going to not going to buy another graphics card until i need it If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Too much stuff on me. Oh, miscounted that. Here. Demon Slayer, that's, that kind of sounds familiar. I'm guessing it's a game? Yeah, I'm not 100%. An anime. I'm not. Uh, yeah, I'm not 100 about that. Cause I have a buddy that like is 
kind of into animated stuff and he, he used to show me a bunch back in the day so i may have seen some of it but i don't know unfortunately they kind of all have titles like that so <laughs> it's really hard to tell i might be thinking of I might be thinking of one called Goblin Slayer. I definitely saw one called Goblin Slayer. I don't remember what Demon Slayer. Everwood Twine Fruit Hide. Oh, is it new? Oh, then uh, probably not. Yeah, unfortunately, I haven't I haven't seen any like new anime at all. It has been a very long time. I was watching um, the, the latest thing I was watching was called uh, it was a Ninja Scroll the TV series because that was a movie back in the day which it's a little like crude a little raunchy but uh, I didn't know they made a show and it's all right it's very it actually kind of reminds me of Inuyasha it, that kind of like style of animation Alright, this guy here. What was bone from school? Ah, bone spear. Yes, I need that. Bone sword would not be a bad idea, but I think the spear will do. Get a shield. What did I do with that hide? So, is it something you've watched and like it's like really good or? Oh, really? Hmm. All right, there. I'll uh, I'll make a note of it. See if I can find it. You ever see one called uh, Berserk? Have you ever watched that one? Berserk is like a uh, super bloody anime about a basically a pissed off dude with a giant sword. That's your favorite one of all time? <laughs> it's pretty badass. It is a crazy, crazy show. Uh, I actually bought the game recently. It, there was there's a game based on on that um, on the series, and uh, and it was on sale not that long ago. I haven't played it yet, but uh, but it looks pretty dope. 
it would be hard to believe that they could get it wrong, you know? Yeah. Yeah, it's on Steam. Uh, let's see, it's called... Uh, where is it? Uh, <laughs> I just, yeah, completely sidetracked you now, huh? What the hell is it? Yeah, right here. Uh, Berserk and the bat the Band of the Hawk. Uh, it was made in 2017. Oh, gosh. Yeah, so right now it's 50 bucks. And that doesn't even include, like, the DLC. Um, I, bought it, I bought it on sale, and I don't remember how much it was, but... I mean, it probably was like 50% off. And then it also had like some additional, it says the additional scenario set is part of the stuff that I got. Uh, but hey, the Steam Summer Sale is coming up. It, I think it's next month. So I would recommend waiting and picking it up when it uh, when it goes on sale. But that's one I would love to like jump on a stream. Um, oh, damn. I didn't change it. I didn't change it. Can't have that. But I'm definitely going to put some kind of a uh, more. Yeah, when you have some money. I know, dude. Like, like I said, well, when it, when it goes on sale, it shouldn't be too bad. Like, I think it was like 25 bucks. Which, I mean, you know, it's a little bit, but. But if you can get it on sale, then it's, I would say it's worth picking up. I can't believe it's $50, like, still, like, it's a five-year-old game. Yeah, no kidding, huh? Well, I think it's like the people that are, like, that know about that show and would, like, play that game, like, they don't really care about the price, right? They're like, they're like, they're gonna buy it because they want it. There's probably not that many people that have never, like, watched the show that would buy that game, you know? They wouldn't, I don't think they would understand, like, what it's about. Not that it's that much to understand, I guess. Guy has a giant sword. He's pissed off. He destroys the ever-living shit out of everything. Oh, the manga. Oh, dude. I didn't even... Well, I guess I, I assume that there was something like that. But yeah, I've, I've never even considered looking at that. That would be pretty awesome, I would imagine. I mean, I imagine the show is based on the manga. But, you know, there's probably way more to it than what they were able to actually put in the show. <coughs> Alright, give me the copper ore. Give me that. Give me this. Give me this. I should be able to take the rest of this, yeah? No? Ah. Hmm. Did not make uh, this horse any food. Uh, 
<laughs> Clapping demon cheeks. <laughs> yep, that's kind of his thing. That's that's kind of what he does. Do you need a tannery? Oh, I also need a carpentry bench. Wood. No, oh, that's actually helpful. Okay. Yep, no worries. This in here. Not gonna build me much, but it will be a start. Let's see if I can make that bow. Build. Uh, right, the twine and the hide. What did I do with that hide? Did, did I not? Did I leave all that other hide over there? Darn it. Oh, so this uses ore and this uses ingot. Huh, all right. Guess who's back? Uh, I'm gonna guess. Take a wild stab and say. You're back! So I'm going to do a little hunt, get some, uh, get some hide. It shouldn't be too big of a deal, and I need that uh, copper. So find some copper. Then I'll get that this stuff uh, going, and then we can, perhaps we could switch it up. Oh, I need to mark this base also. Oh, it's already marked for me. Cool. That, that's stone, right? Or no, this is, uh, is this iron? Yeah, this is iron. That is good stuff right here. Yeah. 
Now let's see if I can do this without dying. Or having my horse fall down the mountain. Or me falling down the mountain. Oh, I didn't make that other bow. Damn it. Kind of need that. Ooh. I don't like the sliding. That's how horses die. Oh, this actually should be enough copper to get me going. Um, I don't think it's been quite a year yet, because I probably started streaming in September, I want to say. No, actually, or was it before? I think, like, when I started streaming, like, full-time, I think it was, like, somewhere around there. Is it? Actually, I do see it chopping. What is that about? Hmm. I'm not sure why I was doing that. Uh, it doesn't seem to be any better, does it? Yeah, I don't know what caused that. That's kind of weird. I'm looking at him like, I'm not seeing anything. I didn't drop frames or anything. Also... What, I like teleport? How the hell did I get so far over here? Yeah, what up? Oh, shit. Oh, shit, he saw me. Run away! What I want to do is go down there and kill those guys, and then get, like, an epic ton of copper. Um, but I kind of need the better weapons for that.
grab that, and that should complete that quest. Yep. That's telling me to build armor, but there's no way I'm building armor before a weapon. Right, I needed the hide. Ay, ay, ay. I need more than five, right? Shite. I need six. How did I not bring any hide? Could be a deer or something around here. Fox or a something, something. Oh, you know what really sucked too is on the uh, the last time I was playing this game, like online, there was like an event. I think it was the Chinese New Year, and there was these crates that would like, like airdrop in. And you get, like, all sorts of good stuff. I had so much good gear. Like, I had so many things that were freaking awesome. Um, and then I didn't log in for a couple days. Literally lost all of it. Like, I wish I would have, like, handed it off to my guild. I'm like, here, you guys do something with this because... I mean, there was stuff in there that, like, I wasn't even high enough level. Oh, okay. Well, pleasure, Aaron. I guess we uh, kind of assumed your name was Brad. And it's funny too because my buddy Kevin, um, <laughs> when we were playing Sea of Thieves, I was I was mentioning to you, and he was like, he's like, oh, I thought that was like our buddy Brad. Like we we know a guy named Brad from like a while back. I mean, I haven't seen him in a while, but um, <laughs> he's like, oh, I thought that was like our buddy, like Brad that used to come over. Like, no. Oh, so you're like, like a junior, like Brad Junior, and then uh... this is one beefy deer. Oh, okay. There it goes. Alright, that should be enough hide. Oh, really? Oh, that's hilarious. Well, that makes for a fitting username for sure.
Ooh, we got some of that flying hide. Oh, actually, that can't make those bronze tools yet. All right, so let's. All right, I guess bronze bronze armor it is. <laughs> I know, hey, believe me, I know that feeling. My buddies my buddies have been uh Well, they've been calling me Billy this whole time. I was like, who the hell's Billy? <laughs> but I've known them since I was like shit, probably like Probably since like seventh grade. So <laughs> I don't I don't generally go by Billy anymore, but uh but people that have known me forever, you know, it's like, yeah, whatever. That's that's fine. some new armor all right between the bow and the armor and the bone spear i should be okay to go take that down and then i think that'll be a good time to call it a day of this game Nice. Like five, six years? Heck yeah. Well, my buddy Kyle uh, Riddle is actually uh, probably five years younger than me. And I knew his, his brother, who's like a year older than me, way before I, I knew him. Um, but then, like, I became better friends with Kyle than his brother. Uh, also, his brother, like, joined the army and, like, you know, like left, <laughs> like I was gone, uh, for quite a while. So, uh, yeah. So me, me and his brother were like good friends. It's kind of funny how that works. Damn it. I need more hide. Make this full set of armor. Oh, really? Oh, that's interesting. Hey, why you guys killing foxes over here? Oh, shit.
Ah, <laughs> they got him. Stabbed him in the butt as he was running by. Well, I mean, that's kind of cool. That means you guys, like, actually have a family that's related, right? So it's your, like, let's see, a half-cousin? Would be, like, your aunt's... How is that? Wait, wait. Yeah, it'd be your, like, an aunt or uncle's... Son? Oh, that'd be a cousin. Son. Son by marriage. Or... Wait. Yeah, how does that work? Wait. <laughs> Half cousin. I mean, yeah, just the term half cousin seems kind of weird because either that means that somehow he's either related to you or it's like, like your aunt and her, like, or say like an aunt or, or uncle got divorced and then remarried and then had a son with a different person, but that would still make him your cousin. That wouldn't really make a half cousin. I don't know. Those terms are definitely weird. Two boots. Sweet. Got the dupe. Armor. Dupe. The boots. Make a good helmet. And that'll be the good bow. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. So the next thing would be there's. I know there's a bronze bow, but I must not have the stuff for it yet. All right, so we're going to be pretty close here. As soon as that helmet's done, we'll go kick some ass, make a bunch of arrows.
bandages. I think I need that station for that, or do I? No, wood ash and wildflower. What did I do to that ash? It's probably still on. Oops. This makes, I think this makes other stuff. Bone meal? I don't need that. So I need some hardwood in this bench. No. I mean, it's blocked. What's it blocked by? What you talking about? Alright, so once I get the gardening going, I can do this. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Probably feed my horse before he starves to death. Oh yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I'm gonna. I'll, I'm working tonight, so I'll see, like, if the Xbox Live thing works on my laptop. Like, if if that works, like that is gonna be super awesome, and then I'll probably start getting into those games. Um, I just, I, I just don't know how much I'm gonna use it outside of, like, work. But we'll see. I mean, it just kind of depends on who's on and who's around and, like, what I feel like playing, I guess. I am not 100% about that. I mean, it does look interesting, but, uh, like I said, I'll... I'll I gotta, I gotta see what's up with that, uh, the cloud gaming portion of that, um, Xbox Live Game Pass. Because the problem is, like, it, if I don't use it at work, I don't know if I'm gonna hang on to it or not. Because, like, see if these is cool, but, actually, you know what, see if the, I'm, if it's a dollar, if this summer sale comes on and that, and it goes on sale, maybe I'll just buy it. Because I don't really want to spend what is it forty fifty bucks on that game, um, because I'm only I'm I don't think I'm going to be playing it all that much, unless everybody else is on the planet too, you know. I guess it's possible. I have a feeling you might twist my arm a little bit on it. So 
So you don't you don't do like a match like any kind of matchmaking and just join someone else's crew when you get on? Like you just do a lot of like solo stuff? Or were you just doing that like the the last time you were playing? Oh, okay. So, I mean, what kind of missions do you usually run then? Because, like, the ones where you're, like, hunting dudes down, like, there was a lot of guys, like, you, like, just fight tons of skeletons solo. Or, you, or do you just, like, generally find the, like, uh, digging... Finding buried treasures and all that good stuff. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah. You just find the buried treasure ones? I mean, that seems like a good way to go, because you're quick. Like, you don't have to, like, spend so much time fighting all those dudes. And then I'm guessing most of the time you're not like, you're not fighting other ships. I mean, maybe small ships, but you're probably not fighting any like big ships, right? Cause that sounds like it'd be a, a giant pain in the butt. Yes, helmet. All right, so we got full gear now. Alright, time to distribute this creep. Sea chest, sea chest, that's gonna go over there. Underwater place. Oh, wait, is that the, um, they were telling me about that, the uh, siren's nest? raining here is oh I was supposed to make regular bronze armor Yeah, like, so you just go down and, like, find treasure there? Sounds cool. This extra grass. Yeah, the sharks, man, they get you pretty quick, don't they? I was like swimming, uh, like. 
sometimes those sharks show up within like a moment of you going somewhere. You're like, what the hell, man? Now these aren't degrading very fast. I guess I don't need all that bone. All right, screw it. That's going on the horse anyway, so... All right. We're going to sneak attack in the rain, in the dark. And hopefully I can get a bunch of copper, and then uh, once I get the copper, I'll bring it back, throw it in the smelter, and we'll call it a day. I don't think it's going to smelt while I'm offline, but it doesn't matter. It don't matter. Worry about that next time. But at least the horse has got food. The base is built. Put the put the rest of the roof on it here when I get back. Okay, I'm gonna have to start going over the ridge the other way. This is very steep. The steep ridge. This is no Skyrim horse. Oh, really? If you got hurt? Yeah, because you're like bleeding into the water kind of thing. That, uh, that definitely makes sense. Why is this so difficult? What the hell? All right, what the fuck is going on here? I'm definitely going the long way around. What? Wow, okay, that's not...
Something didn't work right there. Nope, 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 not gonna risk it. Oh god, the hops. Ugh, that jumped them. I don't recall having so much difficulty getting up over this mountain before. Oh, Destiny and the DLCs. I haven't played. I haven't played Destiny in a minute. I should probably get back into it. Oh, I started playing the uh, Assassin's Creed Three uh, remastered. So that's like I've been. Play oh shit! Oh, I didn't mean to get everybody. Now we can pick them off. There we go. Yeah. Definitely didn't want two of these guys. Is he trying to throw stuff at me? Seems like a mistake, buddy. This guy's kicking my ass. Holy shit, he almost killed me. Um, girl or boy one? Uh, it's the one where you're, like, you start off as the, um... It's like, almost like, I'm gonna say like, um, colonial times where the British are on like the United States before the Civil War, or the, um, 
war for independence kind of stuff um so you you play as like the half native american half um uh what is he he's a i want to say illuminati but he's not illuminati he's uh the masons or whatever right No, he killed my horse. Oh, you bastards. That horse was supposed to collect the loot. really don't want to hand-to-hand -hand this guy. Oh, I don't have a choice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there, there's, like, quite a few that I didn't play in between... I guess it's three and... Because there's like a, a whole ton of like liberation ones. Different areas, different parts of the world. I just remember, I remember from playing it back in the day that 3 was really good. Are pretty good. Um, it's just been so long since I played it, and I'm like, oh, all right, I'm gonna go back and. It was like, I forgot exactly how it works, but like on on Google Stadia, I had um, I had like they gave me like a ten dollar off pass or something like that, like a coupon for ten bucks, and that game was like literally like eleven ninety nine, so I got the game for like two dollars. Dang it, I don't think I have enough to do this. Alright, alright. Gonna go regroup. I think I need more bandages. Ah, uh, that sucks that they killed my horse, because I need to I, I need to build a stable, but the only way to build a stable. Or no. I should be able to build a stable. It used to be that it, it was a guild building. <clears throat> well, that could have gone better. Yeah, I think the other problem is that the bronze armor, even though it seems like it's the worst, ar worser, worse of the armor, um, is actually it's light armor versus heavy armor. It doesn't really matter. The skill will build real quick, but had I thought about that, I probably would have gone for the light armor. You know what? It's alright. It's fine. It's fine. You know? It's all good. It's all good. I was just testing them out. Seeing how, uh, how strong they were. How skilled they were.
Oh, I guess I should have put that in there. A bronze axe, huh? Should not a bronze throwing axe, but an actual bronze axe, which there we go. So what I needed. Do need a bronze spear. That would be that would be the way. Bronze shield wouldn't hurt either. Yeah, let's do that. Weapon upgrades. Oh, that needs fine hide. Damn that hide is fine. Some of this, some of that. Bada bing, bada boom, bronze axe. I'll need a bronze hammer. Actually, a bronze hammer would be way more useful than a bronze axe. Um, well, where are you seeing that, Bam? Because Myth of Empires isn't on Steam anymore. Like, you can buy it through their website. But, like, they took it off Steam a while back. Oh, from their website, yeah. Yeah, so that's, right now, that's the only place you can get it. Which is, like, I guess it's cool, but I don't know if it, like, you can still connect. Right, like, I don't know how it would send you, like, a friend request or, like, invite you to my... Actually, you could... Actually, I take that back. Because you could connect to my server if I gave you the, the login information. That is a possibility. Do I not have enough... No, up right here, 612. I should be able to build that. Oh, it's probably because of these. Alright, that's fine. You know, you know. My pole arm skill is pretty crap. Of anything in it. Bow skill's not great either. Oh, increased total stamina. Hell yeah. Oh, mining stuff, yes. Identify copper from the distance. It's perfect. Death by animals.
Production. Oh, what's up, dude? How goes it? Ability, rate of obedience. Oh. Responder market resources levying. Oh, okay. Oh, so so that was so you literally went and talked to the agency. It's kind of weird that they had you go in to do that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. Well, I mean, sounds good. Oh really? Yeah. Well, some I mean I don't know. Some companies that are like big have um, like literally they have temp agencies in their office, like in their build building that like do their HR. Which to me is kind of a weird way to do it, but hey, whatever. Oh, it's in, oh really? It's in town too. Wow. Where it, where is it at? Is it? It's not Megan, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think Milgard was one of them that I was like, I, I noticed that with. Is it really? Holy cow. Oh, you don't even know what, what the company is? You just know that it's in Simi? That's kind of wild. Well, I'm just thinking because they're, I mean, yeah, yeah, that was the only way to get it at Milgard, yeah. Which? Woo, I got it at Milgard, yay. <laughs> they have like uh, guys holding signs out in the street now. I don't know if you noticed that. Last time I was in Seam, I was like, oh, dude, look at this guy. I know, like, everybody that's needed a job has worked at, like, Milgard, for sure. Like, they must really be running out of people. That <laughs> door, yeah. I mean, it should. It should say, uh, if you're one of the few people that haven't worked here yet, come do your time and then bounce after a week because it's terrible. Yeah, I, I, dude, I was only there for like, what, two days? And I was like, yeah, screw this. I ain't doing this shit. Well, I just did their, like, tour and their, like, sit-down chatting BS, and then I'm like, yeah, I'm not doing this. I mean, you're, you're a trooper. You're there longer than most, that's for sure. Hell, Wally -E didn't even get in. <laughs> Wally -E filled... Dude, he was working at a flooring store and filled the thing about, like, how to read a tape measure. And it's like, dude, how do you... I know, right? He's, like, the only person I can imagine that, like, didn't get in. And I'm like, what? 
And it's like, you work in a... F no, he, he failed the, like, written test because he couldn't read a tape measure. And it's like, bro, you work at a flooring store as a salesperson. Like, how do you... How do you not know how to read a tape measure? And he, he told him, he's like, well, I, I'm, I'm used to like reading it in decimals. I'm like, what are you talking about? Like, it's it's way harder to read it as a decimal, dude. Like, what do you mean? He's like, bro, what's 132nd as a decimal? Like, wh what are you talking about, dude? Yeah. <laughs> I know, it's just ridiculous. It's like, what are you doing? And he's like, well, and I think it's, and that's what it is, is that they had, um, his uncle gave him this, like, laser measuring thing, and that's probably what he's, what happened was that he never measured anything in his life. He just put the thing in, turned on the, le the um, laser, and the laser would tell him the distance, and it would show it as, like, you know, two feet point, you know, 2.64 feet or whatever, like, so he was literally just writing down what the thing said and like literally had no idea or understanding of like how the actual measurement was taking place. Just kind of funny. <laughs> I know, right? It's like, no wonder, no wonder your uncle didn't want you there, man. He's like, you're done. I know, like, literally, like, that's what it was. That's what the test was. It was, like, literally reading the lines on the ruler, like, and he couldn't, couldn't do it, man. He didn't know. He didn't know how to do it. Pretty, pretty basic stuff there. So are you, uh, it sounds like you might be available for some, uh, pirate booty action, huh? All right. So I need, oh, right. My horse died. I need a freaking stable to res my horse. Rubble ingot. Rubble. Twenty ingot. I have twenty ingot. Probably have ten. Ah. Probably shouldn't have built all this crap. I mean, I need it, but. Three. Ay, ay, ay. Um... Well, no, uh, well, Bam, uh, was, was going to get on also, or he is on, um, just doing some solo stuff, but I'm like, yeah, we should we should all hop on and uh, and play. Like I was playing with those guys. Like we, we played quite a bit. Like you never you didn't come back last night, but we actually played. Um, we helped those guys out. We didn't beat the mission. Like we failed the mission, but it was cool. Like we summoned the ghost megalodon, and like we tried to fight him, but. Um, we were not ready. We were not prepared for, for the brutal. Uh, rank in Sea of Thieves? Like in the what? What, what do you mean, clan? Are you talking about uh, your clan? Like the, in, are you talking about Warframe or? I am confused. Well, though, the problem is that, that since you can only squad with four people, that we had, like, too many people. 
I mean, we still may have too many people if, uh, you know, if everybody else gets on. But but we, what we're talking about with those other guys is that we can, like, basically take over a server. It's just you have to, like, jump around um, until you run into, like, you know, you basically hop into a server, sail over to a certain place, and see if, you know, our, our people are there. Oh, I should probably update that while we're... Oh, God, don't slide down this. Oh, shit, this is steep. This is steep. Oh, God. Oh, no. I don't want to die. This is this mountain is, like, way more steep than I thought it was. Or that I would imagine it should be. So I could use the hide. On the damn wrong side of the. That's the base. The copper's over there. Where the hell am I? I'm not right there. That's not right. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, and that's what he's saying. Is like, I think, I think he said there was only sixteen people in a server. So I mean, we would have like eight people in it. So we would literally be half the server. And it's like, oh, you want to mess with us, huh? Oh, someone's being an a-hole? <laughs> I mean, if we had 12, like, if we had the four we had, at, well, and then with those other guys, we would have, we would have eight. <laughs> well, the thing is, the soups are faster than galleons, though. So it actually is kind of beneficial to have different size ships. Oh, I was... Dude, at the end of the day, Kevin just, like, took off. He didn't really even say anything. I mean, he, he did say that he was going to take off, but, like, when he took off, he didn't actually, like, say, oh, okay, I'm out of here, bye, guys. He's just like, boop, he left. Like, oh, okay, I guess he's done then. So the other guys were, like, going to go fight this other dude. Uh, it was, like, sloop versus sloop action. And then, literally, I had the galleon because we were in two different places. So I'm, like, st I, I literally st steered the galleon all the way over there by myself and, like, tried to, like, fight the guy. And, man, I couldn't, I couldn't keep up with it because the galleon was getting damaged in the storm. So, like, I couldn't, like, repair it and then, like, sail at the same time. It was just not, <laughs> just not doable. Oh, you, uh, you just redeemed your things for for something in Warframe. I don't have a companion in this game. <laughs> I should be able to, be able to uh, refund the channel points to you, though. <coughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's funny. Let's see if this guy notices that arrow in his face. Um. Well, I guess it's the, it's the. The question of whether we're going to join yours or... Shit. Well, if, if we're going to all join yours, then we're going to take 
uh, the Brigantine, right? Heal myself. Uh, if I take this guy, I can sneak. Oh shit, there's two guys over there. There's too many guys. Too many guys. They're... I've got this too well guarded. Be right back, okay? Yep, no worries. Yeah, I'll be just a minute. As much as I want, I need this copper. Oh, I need like arrows to the face. It's interrupting my shots. Oh my god. Archer sucks. There you go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did those guys notice me? Oh, I got him. Take that. Yes, son of a bug. Rebel scum. I'm back, baby! Hey. Do that. Three guys there, and I can't. Even if I picked them off, I don't. I don't think I could do it. All right, all right. As soon as I get back, I'll. Uh, I wanted to build that stable, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to. Oh, actually, maybe I maybe I can. Sixty? That's. I think it's four to one. So if I can make ten, then I can make this table. Then I can resurrect my horse, and then I'll have enough storage space to uh, to get loads of copper. Yes, excellent. <laughs> you need money, man. I need money too. I, I literally lost money when we were playing last. <laughs> I spent more money than I gained. The other thing is too is like, when we when we joined the alliance, I was even thinking I'm like, wait a second, isn't there some kind of like sharing gold thing that happens when you when you're in alliance with somebody? 
<laughs> you only have 20. <laughs> well, I also bought a, a hook hand and a peg leg, so I could I couldn't resist. So I I definitely am lacking on funds. Well, 23 gold is pretty damn broke for a pirate. I mean, that's that's hardly a glass of grog. All right, what do I, what do I need for this? Hardwood. Hey there. Did I retwine? Shit, did I use the hard hardwood? Oh no, I got it right there. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I just started and I got I have more gold than you do. That's weird. What did you spend all your gold on? You must have some good stuff, man. Like did you get it like Cosmetic stuff. I mean, there there are just. Were you spending on like uh, cannonballs and all that good stuff? Yeah, I, I do need that piece. I stuff for your ship, yeah. <coughs> I'm not waiting 13 minutes for that, so we will do that next time. Nani? All right, so, um, yep, that, that'll do it for me on this. Uh, but we moved our base. Uh, I was able to get into the Bronze Age here and get my bronze armor and weapons and equipment. So once I resurrect my horse, I'll get enough bronze to make the stuff, the the um, benches that I need out of bronze, and then we'll uh, move on to the Iron Age. But it's pretty good progress. Um, the next thing would be, yeah, once I do that, get to the iron stuff, uh, then we can attack the uh, city, or at least I can start to start messing with the city. Uh, yeah, so yeah, stick around or come on back. Uh, we're gonna play some CFDs here shortly. So um, yep, just need to update and all that good stuff. I mean, we don't need Neo. We can we can jump in, and if he comes in, then we can get a different ship or whatever. <laughs> I know. Well, the thing is, too, is that when we joined that alliance, all that stuff that we we got, like, we literally gave them 50% of it. Like, f half the money that we earned went to those guys. I mean, which is stupid because, the, like, the one guy literally had, like, millions. Like, it wasn't that they were doing that on purpose. It just was, like, it just so happened that when we joined that alliance, they get, we share 50% of the loot. Yeah, yeah. So... It was just dumb. Like we should have, we should have started the alliance after we went back to the to the main outpost and then turned our stuff in because we needed the money way more than they did. They didn't need it. It was nothing compared to like the amounts that they had. So, right, right, right. So for future reference, yeah. <laughs> well, if we make the alliance before the quest, that's fine too. So, yeah, because they were even saying like, yeah, like. Yeah, we ended up getting, we started getting some money and it was like, oh, well, that sucks. <laughs> but to them, you know, drop in the bucket. But right, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream, um, update the other game, and um, I guess we'll meet in the that the bigger Discord. Um, the Discord that we were playing in, you know, we're in yesterday, so. 
that way if any, any of those other guys are on we can coordinate so thanks again guys uh we will see you shortly Thank <laughs> you.